Merry Christmas, YouTube. I hope everyone's having a wonderful holiday. Even if you don't celebrate Christmas, eat some chocolate today. That's, that's always a good thing to do. Uh, and welcome to a video that uh, I'm just so underwhelmed by today's offers. I'm as underwhelmed today, if not more, than I was on Cyber Monday, and that's really saying something. Kabam has just had selective amnesia. They have forgotten what they gave us. And, and what I'm going to do specifically is talk about this $3,100, $100 unit deal because... I find it so perplexing that they would celebrate America's independence on July 4th more than they would Christmas, a holiday that all countries celebrate in some way, even, even Kazakhstan. I have no idea why I chose that country, but you get the idea. Um, if you are forgetting, or you maybe are new to the game, on July 4th, we were given 6,000 five-star Hero Crystal Treads, which, you know, it's 1,500 less than this, and a five-star class Awakening Gym Crystal plus the 3,100 units. $400. Now they've upped to the five star Hero Crystal shards by 1500 although with the state of the game and how much easier that those are to get since July, that's really not an evolution. Uh, and then given us two four star crystals, a boost, and one energy refill. I just don't get it. Uh, I will say this if you get this offer, save your shards for Blade. It is becoming quite clear that the game is all about the haves and the have-nots, specifically who has Blade and who doesn't. This is not a video that I'm trying to get Blade to be nerfed. I love my Blade. I love how instead of nerfing magic, they created Blade. So my advice to Kabam if they're watching this is don't nerf Blade. Create a character that maybe counters Blade's danger sense and have that be someone that makes you money because then we're spending our 15 k five star shards in order to try to open this person and so you're actually benefiting from this so instead of nerfing a character you're creating a new character that the community gets super hyped about that's the way to do it but uh, personally i'm in a unique situation so i've got over 200 dollars of itunes credit i could get this deal for free it would cost me nothing and i'm still hesitant i'm still hesitant because there's no awakening gym and i just i'm so frustrated so please comment below and let me know whether or not you think this is worth it. And my final prediction for the year, I was right about Black Friday setting up Cyber Monday. I think that today's Christmas deal is setting up a mega unit offer on, on uh, New Year's Eve. Uh, last year they did something kind of similar. And so if you get your units and you've already gotten all your gifting milestones, don't spend these units on gifts especially because the greater gifting crystals have been so underwhelming. Uh, save these units for those those 10k, even 15k unit offers so you can get those for free and pick up like at least half a, a T2 Alpha and some more 5-star shards out of the deal. So anyhow, have a wonderful holiday. Thank you for your support. I just started making these MCOC videos in August. I really had no idea if, if people were even going to watch. And now I'm, I'm close to 1,000 subscribers. I, I've received such great feedback. Hey, even if you hate everything I say and just click a video to dislike it, I still support, uh, I still appreciate your support. So have a great holiday. Uh, comment below to let me know if you're going to purchase this. And my final two messages, save your shards for Blade, February 22nd. Circle the date on your calendar. And also, save your units, because there's going to be something in about six days, I think, that you're going to be able to spend them on and get pretty good value.